Thank you so much, Yael, and everybody here on this call. I'm so grateful for this. I just want to explain my love also. Oh, thank you so much. It is heartfelt. <laughs> and um, I was wondering, I've heard in a, in a different transmission that um, everybody that is now living on this planet will come along to this shift of the earth like to go to 5d and uh, in, instead of 3d and i'm i have a hard time um, imagining that there are several or are there several earths <laughs> um, right now i was maybe i have been too, too much focused on this um, reality as it ex exposes itself um, with this lot of contrast people are pushing against those those like the evil things that that are not um, that don't really feel good in the development of the earth and there are other people who kind of choose to be more a light worker and to be a little bit in the background and just concentrate on their high frequency. Um, yes. So is what you heard in this other transmission, which wasn't us, as we understand, yeah. uh -huh. somebody said everybody on earth today will go to the 5d energy frequency in a sense is what they posted right yeah or maybe so, i just understood it like this if, if if that's okay with you let us just yes. respond to that to that okay. statement to make it yes. more simple so okay. from our point of view you all you do all everybody who is on your planet today has a choice to move in that direction but it is okay. your free choice you are not being forced by any means you have a free choice to allow yourself to shift into that direction and in a sense 5d as you term that idea mm -hmm. is in you now it's in you now and it is a gradual shift very often people think this is going to be a one to the next day kind of super transformation and we're not saying that in some versions of reality this does not exist but it is very 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 rare most of you will choose a gradual transition and so we would love to remind you first of all that 5d the idea of that the energy frequency you're encompassing it it is within you right now that's why when you fall in love right now you feel like you're there right now it's accessible for you right now whether you fall in love with another person or with yourself or with life in general you can live it right now that version of Earth is overlaying or overlapping, if you wish to look at this multidimensionally, the version of Earth that you're on. But really, this is such an interesting time because depending on your personal point of focus, you will be seeing proof, quote unquote, of the one or the other being more present in your version of reality. And everything, literally everything, in between that idea of the old 3d quote unquote no offense and this is very valuable and beautiful as a journey onto itself and the new 5d not idealizing it and not putting it on a pedestal either both of them are coexisting right now and by remaining neutral and that's why we're softening out these labels so much right now remaining neutral about these ideas you take the pressure off of yourselves because the more you speak in extremes bad person good person 3d 5d and so forth you you make it very black and white you actually add to the illusion of friction and polarity that is there as such a lush and wonderful ingredient for you to play with it isn't meant in that sense to be used as a weapon one against the other so these are labels that generally we stay away from we don't speak much you don't hear us about when you move into 5d because it is very confusing and when we make statements if we were to choose to make such statements the general response of most of humanity is a bit of an agenda oriented one you immediately go into the when we get there so in other words if we would use that type of definition it pulls you out of the here and now is what we feel happens in your energy frequency 
frequency when this is how it's being translated. So we actually refrain from that. We stay away from it as far as possible. You are beautiful right here, right now. Every single one of you is. You all have the possibility or you wouldn't be on the planet today, right here, right now. You have the possibility within your core to within this incarnation experience that shift but you do not have to and possibility and probability are two different things and the difference between them expresses itself in the amount of a momentum towards the one direction or the other and you can trace back where your momentum is going by going inward and feeling within yourself where you're at and communicating with your higher self and tuning in what is my definition about this what do i believe about that where am i going what is my motivation for acting like this my motivation for acting like that am i pushing against something or moving towards something you see and by continuously checking in with yourself in that way without making it homework but keeping it play that is how you will suddenly surprisingly find yourself effortlessly in this 5d and it will feel as naturally as anything and your question will be gone Mm -hmm. does that help thank you yeah this is beautiful